What is the best rig for Minecraft animation in Cinema 4D? That's coming right up. Stay tuned. What's up, Survivalists? It's Jay from Team WNJ here. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell icon right now to stay notified whenever I upload a new video every single week. When I think of the best rigs for Cinema 4D for Minecraft animation, these four most popular rigs come into mind. The Weed Lion rig, the FMR rig, the Anish Ridge rig, and the Angelo rig. But which one is the best for you? Let's find out. First of all, the Weed Lion rig is free. However, in my opinion, it is heavily outdated and lacks many features that other rigs have. For instance, take a look at its face. There is a paid version of Weed Lion's rig, but I don't think it's worth it because it doesn't do anything that a free rig can do. Moving on, the FMR rigs are the most versatile rigs that exist. Some of them are free and some of them you have to pay for, but all of them spawn from the original FMR5 rig created by the amazing XIFrost21. I personally use the Team WNJ version of the FMR5 rig known as the FMR Animate that you can download for free right here. I absolutely recommend you use FMR Animate whether you're a beginner or advanced because the FMR Animate rig is optimized for everything an animator needs to use or do. It's a very light Wait, no BS rig that gets the job done well. Not to mention there's tons of tutorials on this rig on this very channel. And if you'd like to see the rig in action, don't forget to check out Levislear episode zero. That's my animated web series where the rig is heavily, heavily used. However, as great as the FMR rigs are, they are not perfect. One of the problems that you're gonna find with the original FMR5 rig is that it is incredibly buggy. And many of the bugs that you're gonna find out there, whether they're paid or free, don't take the time to fix the bugs like I did with FMR Animate. And these aren't just bugs that you can hit undo to fix. No, these are bugs that will straight up break your rig and break your entire animation. Now, FMR Animate isn't perfect either, as if you're using any version above Cinema R18, you're gonna run into some very major issues. For instance, if you wanna do any sort of extrusions with any FMR rig, you will need Cinema 4D R18 or below. Now, this might not be a problem for some of you, but R19 has some of the most amazing and advanced features that you will want to boost your animation. Fortunately though, the next two rigs will solve your problem. The next two rigs are the Anish Ridge rig and the Angelo rig. These are the most famous and some of the best, most sought after rigs out there. They are basically on the same level as Blue Monkey animations or Element animations. So let's take a look at the third rig, Anish Ridge. This one you're probably very familiar with as it is one of the most famous rigs out there and it's so advanced with so many different features. However, as you'll learn, that's not necessarily a good thing. Coming in at $25 with no demo version, you will not be able to test whether this rig works with your system and whether you like it until you actually spend the money to buy it. This means the risk of using this rig is incredibly high. Fortunately, I have purchased the rig and I can tell you my true thoughts on it. Now listen carefully, especially if you're a beginner looking to go advanced. The Anish Ridge rig is great in that it has so many features and so many things you can do to easily customize your rig. It has features like auto walk, auto run, lip sync, smart move, and smart look. But I think that the key features of this rig are its facial features. The face on this rig is downright amazing. Everything you move distorts the face in a very aesthetically pleasing way that really helps to sell that cartoon feeling. As far as I'm aware, there is no other rig out there that has a face that even comes close to the Anish Ridge face. So what about the other features that promises to save you time such as auto walk and smart move? Well, don't be fooled by the amount of cool features and complex looking expresso graphs and whatnot. It's a bit of smoke and mirrors going on here. Features such as smart move and smart look are highly overrated and are used to trick beginner animators looking for a shortcut into paying $25 for something they wish they never had. First of all, if you wanna to try to make sure features like Smart Move and Smart Look actually work, look no further than the free FMR Animate rig that I mentioned earlier. You will find that those features are actually not that useful as it's very difficult to do a precise action when everything is moving automatically. The difference here is that in FMR Animate, 
turning it on and off is as simple as pressing one button. While in Anish Ridge, there are so many different buttons and features, you've actively got to search for the correct one. The second thing that attracts a lot of beginner animators looking for a cheap shortcut is auto walk. This is important, especially if you're a beginner. Work on your walk cycles. Auto walk is only reserved for background characters. So if you're a beginner, you're very likely not going to be using background characters anyway. And if you do, it's likely that your computer will not be good enough to run a background crowd simulation, especially using the Anish Ridge ring. The reason you don't want auto walk on your main character is because once again, it's very difficult to control. It's difficult to say, walk here at this speed, stop here, then turn, then walk backwards over there. It's also very difficult to transfer the walk animation into something else. Say for example, if he's, if he's walking and picking up something or walking and then sprinting. Not to mention, if everyone has the same walk animation, it will feel very robotic and very unnatural. And as I've mentioned earlier, the Anish Ridge rig is not a lightweight rig. Yes, you can do some complex sequence of compressions and level of detail changes using the tier system that Anish implemented. But why would you need that? Yes, the main character would benefit from higher detail, but what difference does that make in a Minecraft animation? Speaking of the tier system, once you convert the Anish Ridge rig into a tier one rig where all the main features are gone, it actually breaks the rig and is incredibly hard to go back to normal. Right here is an example of the Q switch breaking. This is one of the key features of the rig. Unlike in the FMR rigs where everything is clearly laid out, you can't fix it yourself. So if you use the Anish Ridge rig and it breaks, you have to start everything from the beginning. And if you choose to not change the tiers, you'd have the most system intensive rig for background characters. Even my powerhouse of a computer could not handle that. One of the final features that attracts beginner animators is lip syncing. But then again, lip syncing is free in the FMR animate rig. So I'd recommend downloading that for free to start off with. Now here we are with the final rig. Meet the Angelo rig. Imagine if you could combine everything that the FMR animate does right with everything that Anish Ridge does right and throw everything away that they do badly. Meaning you can use the Angelo rig in any version of Cinema 4D with little to no lag and create huge crowds for your epic scenes and have them all walk automatically without huge lag. Imagine if you could do all of that whenever and wherever you wanted with zero hassle. This is the real deal. It does not rely on a fancy trailer to sell you its advanced features that nobody will ever use. It doesn't try to disguise itself as the most complicated rig ever because it's not and it doesn't have to be. No matter if you're trying to make the best looking still render or the most epic fight scene or the most realistic and the biggest crowd or just a less laggy rig to run better on your computer so you can focus on what's important and make those animations come to life, the Angelo rig solves all those problems at once. No other rig can do what the Angelo rig does all in one go. So if you're a serious animator with a great story to tell, let the Angelo rig help you now. Check the description to find a link to download the rig now and be fast because if you use the promo code Team WNJ on checkout, you get 10% off. So hurry up before the code expires. Now that you've acquired the world's best Minecraft rig for Cinema 4D, let's get your animation skills up as well. Check out this playlist right here for the best Minecraft animation tutorials to turn you from a beginner to a pro in no time. Cheers.